and Stan's there from Dancers Collectibles. Um, have we got a coin video for you this weekend? I have an 1896 United States of America, one silver dollar. Uh, A.G. Stacker out there is from 1776. He's really, really old. He's 1776. I don't have anything from 1776. But believe it or not, I have an 1896. Uh, and here it is. One silver dollar from um, 1896 is over there. Let me see if I can get a little bit. Let's do the shifting there. Um, get it even a little bit taller. Is that going to work? Is that going to work? Uh, there. Look at that. So, um, you've seen the horse blanket uh, video that I did previously, and I'll try and... I'll try and link that somewhere up here. If I can figure out how to do that again, I'll link that video up in here. Uh, this is our second time that we found something like this. I, I Unbelievable, unbelievable. This is the 1896 United States of America. One silver dollar educational note is what this is. Um, it is from the B is in beta. Can, can you see that? There it is. B is in beta 150 series. Um, this is uh, something that you generally don't see. Uh, of course, you generally don't see it. Why else would I have it on here? But this is called a uh, one-year type design. They only did this uh, for this design for one year, and that was it. Um, not like where you see them for 20, 30 years or anything of that nature. Uh, it is a, it is, uh, this is supposed to be history. Um, instructing the youth. The youth is right over here. There's the Constitution over there and Washington, D.C. over here. Um, on the back side, on, on, on the sides here and here are famous people, uh, some presidents, Washington, Jefferson, and some, some notable Americans are, are in the outer area there. Uh, let me show you what the back side looks like, and then let me show you... Um, Again, what it looks like over here. And this is the back side of the bill. It's got Marta over there and Gio over here. Um, there are, of course, as you can see, some condition issues with it. It looks like it was folded one time right around here. And it does look like there are it might have been folded here, here, and here. Um, I am by no means... Uh, an, an excellent grader or any kind of grader that should be in in this oh look at that gorgeous young lady there um, in any uh, way shape or form um, so I, I, I can tell you this um, this this bill is somewhere probably in the um, find extra fine grading uh, which means I, I, I think that the value of this dollar as you're looking at it right now, um, it's probably in the, th the $300 to $500 range. Um, pure guess, pure guess, pure guess. Well, not pure guess, but I, I just don't know. I don't know the grading or anything of that nature as to um, how, they, how anybody would grade this. It is an ungraded coin. Otherwise, it would be in there. Uh, it is ranked uh, number seven of in 100 greatest currency notes by Q. David Bowers. Uh, when they originally came out, there were an estimated 20 million of these. I say 20 million when they first came out. Um, is estimated only seven to 9,000 of these one silver, one silver dollar notes still exist. So uh, of the 20 million, only, only seven to 9,000 still exist. So uh, usually we say coins, 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 coins. Uh, instead, we, we can just say um, currency, uh, one silver dollar, uh, one silver dollar certificate, um, 1896 United States of America, one silver dollar educational note, or as it's known for short, um, one dollar ed. And Dancers Collectibles, hoping that you have a good week.